NASA astronauts share their space station experience, our heavy-duty hauler crawls into the history books and preparing for the return of some historic samples. A few of the stories to tell you about this week at NASA. During the week of March 27th, NASA astronauts Jessica Watkins, Robert Hines, and Chell Lindgren visited the Washington, D.C. area to share the experience of their SpaceX Crew-4 mission to the International Space Station. The visit included an employee event at NASA headquarters, as well as an event at the Martin Luther King Jr. Memorial Library to help students learn about our Artemis missions to the moon. The next time our Crawler Transporter 2, or CT-2, carries the mobile launcher and Artemis moon rocket to the launch pad, the heavy-duty hauler will also carry the official Guinness World Records designation recently bestowed upon it as the heaviest self-powered vehicle. The CT-2 weighs about 6.65 million pounds, the equivalent of about 1,000 pickup trucks. NASA's OSIRIS-REx team is preparing for the spacecraft to return the sample material it collected from asteroid Bennu. The OREx sample capsule is expected to touch down in the Utah desert on September 24th, becoming the first ever U.S. mission to return an asteroid sample to Earth. Our Dragonfly mission, scheduled to launch to Saturn's giant moon Titan in 2027, recently passed all the technical requirements and standards of its preliminary design review. Dragonfly will study the chemistry at work on Titan, which could help us better understand the kinds of chemical steps that ultimately led to life here on Earth. That's what's up this week at NASA. For more on these and other stories, follow us on the web at nasa.gov.